drawing. A drawing that shows how different parts go together. Delivery receipt. A form that shows proof or receipt of goods or services. Detailed drawing. A drawing showing a single part of a machine. Dimensioning. The process of placing measurements in a drawing in the metric or English system. Drawing. A picture, diagram made of lines, a graphic representation of real thing, an idea or a design for production or construction. English system. A system of linear measurement where it is based on standard foot. Geometrical construction. The process wherein geometric problems are solved accurately in mechanical drawings. Mechanical drafting. A process for making accurate drawings using special drawing tools and instrument. Metric system. A system of linear measurement which it is based on the standard meter. Orthographic drawing. The object is presented into two or more views by projecting the outline into the planes of projection perpendicular to each other. Pictorial view. The presentation of an object where it is viewed showing the three faces of an object are shown. Requisition form. An official form, a printed document on which a request is made. Sketch. A quickly executed freehand drawing that is not intended as a finished work. materials and tools, its uses and functions. Drawing paper. Various types of drawing papers are available for use but hard and soft surface drawing papers are highly recommended to be the best. This type does not groove easily when pressure is applied to the pencil. Oslo paper is commonly used but band paper is also recommended. Masking tape. This is used for fastening the drawing paper on the drawing table or drawing board because it does not damage the board and it will not damage the paper if it is removed by pulling it off. Pencil sharpener. Pencils should be sharpened whenever they show sign of dullness. Various types and designs are available in the store for use. Eraser. This is used to clean the dirt off the drawing. A soft eraser is advantageous in removing smudges and pencil marks, whereas a harder eraser is useful for making changes and correcting errors in the drawing. Drawing Pencil. This is one of the most important tools in drawing. It comes in various grades. The grade of pencil to be used depends on the quality of paper to be used. You have to take into consideration also the type of line work required. Hard pencils are used where extreme accuracy is required, especially working on graphs, diagrams, and charts. Medium pencils are used for general purpose work in drawing. Soft pencils are too soft to be used in mechanical drafting. They are very useful for artwork of various kinds. Triangular scales. This is a tool generally used when reproducing a drawing in an enlarged or reduced form to some regular proportion. The architect's scale is the most commonly used for general drawing. Its main function is to reproduce the measurements of an object in full size, reduced size, and enlarged size. Erasing Shield This tool is made up of metal with irregular holes. It is a useful tool to protect the rest of the drawing when clearing up smudges, unnecessary pencil lines, and other erasures. Drawing instruments. 
Drawing instruments are used for drawing and designing purposes. Their quality is very essential if you want to have good result. Cheaper drawing tools and instruments do not only provide poor quality results but also do not last long. You have to observe proper handling and care if you want them. T-square. It is a drawing instrument used when making horizontal lines. It is also used for guiding triangles when drawing vertical lines. It is made of wood, plastic, or the combination of both. There are three types of T-square, namely number one, fixed head. The head is fastened to the blade. It is used for ordinary work. Number two, movable head or adjustable head. It has one fixed and one adjustable head and used only for occasional drawing. And number three, detachable head or removable head. It is designed for comfort when carrying the T-square. Triangle. It is a three-sided ruler, which typically has two equal sides meeting at a 90-degree angle and to a third side at 45, 30, including 60-degree angles. It is usually made of plastic and comes in different sizes. If in use, the base of the triangle must rest on the table of the T-square. Drawing a line always starts from the point near the base going upward. Commonly used triangles are letter A, 30 degrees by 60 degrees, and letter B, 45 degrees by 45 degrees. Compass This drawing instrument is used when drawing arcs and circles. It is used in a similar way to a divider. It is composed of one with the pen leg and the needle point leg being held together with the handle. This drawing instrument can be used for both penciling and inking. Divider. This is a drawing instrument used when transferring measurements, dividing lines and arcs into the desired number of equal parts. It can easily transfer accurate measurements by adjusting the divider points. Constant correct practice is necessary before doing an actual work for a quick and easy control when used. Protractor It is a semicircular instrument divided into 180 equal parts, each of which is called a degree. It is used to determine the graduation of the degrees when measuring arcs, angles, and circles. High-quality protractor is usually made of plastic. And now, let's proceed to our short quiz. 